Hello again, this is Kent from simpletutorials.net. Today I'm going to be showing you how to create a simple leaf. Um, first you want to get your pen tool, your busier curve tool. Press this uh, spiral mode and then also go in down here in the shape and click on ellipse. Then you want to click first on the left hand side and then hold your control key down. Make sure it's perfectly horizontal and then click again and then hit enter. And now you have an elliptical uh, object. And mm -hmm. when you need to make this into a path, so you go object to path. Okay, the next thing we want to do, double click, and we want to get this leaf shape. Click on one of his nodes, the top node maybe, and then hold your control key down and move it upwards and then do the same thing with the bottom try to get it as symmetrical as you can if you want to get it perfectly symmetrical you could have drawn a rectangle and centered uh, centered this item inside the rectangle first but and then move these out to the e outer edges but we'll just eye it Okay, now you want to uh, get both of these nodes selected and then click on one of them and hold your control key down and move them to the left or the right, doesn't matter. But right now our, the left is the bottom of the leaf. You see how the leaf is somewhat formed. Okay, and then we want to go into your select key mode. Let's make this green so we can see what we're doing. Okay, we want to do, um, we want to go into a regular pen or bezier mode and then we want to get rid of a shape and we want to draw the middle, I don't know what to call these. Hold your control key down and then click again and hit enter. Okay, so now we have one of these. Uh, one thing that you can do if you want to make these very even, you can duplicate this. And let's change the color. Or let's actually get rid of the fill. And let's give it a stroke. And then let's move this. I'm going to hit Control J. And that allows me to keep the same. Let's make the. Uh, well, we're, we're trying to get a, a little boundary here created. Okay, so that will be our boundary. Now we'll uh, create, let's go to the top most part, click and then go down here at the bottom, hit control, and hit enter, and then double click on that, and then move it like this. And then click your spacebar. Oops, spacebar. And then we can do a Control D to make some copies, and then move them into place. And okay. Then we can hit Control Shift to make to size these things up. Um, here, hold on. Okay, and then I'll move this over a little. Yeah, I'll just leave that the same length. Get rid of that. As you see, that's not really that symmetrical, is it? I'll move these little. I'm using my arrow key. You can all do also do Alt arrow. Let's see. Um, this is too long. You can just eye everything, and maybe we want this a little thicker. So I can go down here and click on 
something a little thicker here. Thicker stroke. And then we can also give this a stroke. We'll give the same stroke as 6. Oops. Oops. Uh, we want to first give it a stroke. And now it's 6. Okay, so, um, and then we can also change the stroke. Hitting the shift key down. I'll hold the shift key down and then click on this green or some other green whatever you want and then we can also do the same thing for the the middle strokes uh, hold the shift key down and hit the green oh uh, one thing that we were missing maybe is to make a little stem And we want to do the same thing for that. Make this uh, 6. And then hold down the shift key. Actually, with a big leaf like this, we probably could just change it to 8. Yeah. Okay. I think that's it. This is Kent from simpletutorials.net. Thank you for watching.